Benjamin Tyler Henry was responsible for the subsequent development of the Winchester 66, 73, other brands. Those guns would not have been possible without his invention and the groundwork that he laid. What made the Henry spectacular for its time was the fact that it used self-contained metallic cartridges that could be loaded in a magazine and just by working a lever you could load, fire, extract, load, fire, extract 60 times a minute. The average Civil War soldier's musket, uh, he was trained to muzzle load that through 11 different steps and it took about 20 seconds a shot. He could do that three times a minute. So 60 shots a minute versus three shots a minute, that's a huge advantage. A couple famous people were given Henry rifles, President Lincoln being one of them. President Lincoln was given an engraved rifle with a beautiful rosewood stock that resides in the Smithsonian. We resurrected the legendary Henry name in uh, 1996 and actually began shipping our first lever actions in 1997. At the time, we felt that there was a demand for a made in America lever action. I saw that we were losing too many products being made overseas and an American brand name being slapped on it and we decided we're gonna be made in America or not made at all. We had a lever action design with a very smooth action. We felt that there was a place for us in the marketplace, and that's how we started Henry Repeating Arms, this next generation. Hopefully, uh, Benjamin Tyler Henry is smiling down upon us and that he's proud of what we've done with his name. Back in the 1860s, they, uh, they built 13,000 guns over a three-year period, and now uh, guns with his name on it, they're sold in 40 countries around the world. Henry is now the leading lever-action manufacturer, so we take great great pride in that.